Hi everyone, welcome back. I have a box from Bomkuhun here. Very naughty, I placed another order. <clears throat> it's my second one in a couple of weeks of each other. But uh, I've just been really looking and I really wanted something. <laughs> so um, obviously I'll keep that fragile sticker, but I just want to get this out of the way. How nice is this? They put the trust the process stamp in the just the right spot for when you open the box. Okay, so we have two packages here, as well as my receipt, which is wrapped up in this gorgeous little package. So let's start with the little one. I always love how beautifully they're packaged. Just so pretty. Okay, so let's open this one up. Okay, so in this package, I have a ton of patches. Um, I I really love the patches that they have at um, Baumkuchen, and I have my olive passport here, which looks pretty brown, right? <laughs> and then I also have a new one, which is the brown, the actual brown one. So um, I thought I might cover these in patches. Not sure, but that's kind of the plan. So I have the um, Wabi Sabi patch here. I have the crane, paper crane. I've got the ginkgo leaf. I love this one. It's the shape the future. Now I'm hoping these are all sticky on the back, but if they're not, I I have already used super glue on one of mine and it worked really well. And the last patch is this really crazy one. It says leave space for the unknown. It's just um, very bright. So it's a bit different to what I would usually use um, on one of my TNs. Not that I've used a lot, but for me, this is a very bright one um, and it's big, right? It takes up the whole space. So. I'm not sure about this one. It may go on like a bag or something instead, but I really like it. I like the idea of leaving space. So um, yes, I thought I would get that one. And then you can see here, I've also grabbed an accordion fold paper notebook. Let's open this one for my passport. Oh, I didn't realize it was kind of watercolory paper. Let's see. I'm not wearing my glasses, so I can't actually see properly. Um, no, it doesn't say anything about the type of paper on there. It just says blank accordion pages. So let's open this up. I mean, it's super simple, right? It's just um, a notebook with accordion pages in it, but pretty cool for mapping out a trip. like. As you go on a trip each day is different and maybe you could have something a line or something that joins them all together or if you can draw then maybe you can draw the landscape each day i just like the idea it's very cool and i'm totally influenced by my friend shauna of course and then lastly if you've watched my um standard size passport videos then you know i have the large version of this pocket this is from 1.61 soft goods if you can read there on this little tag and yeah it's just going to go inside my brown passport um i'm going to just use this as a take with me everywhere like everywhere um and i mean having it in my hands a lot because i'm at that age <laughs> where i kind of forget stuff um i just don't always remember what I need to and uh, I feel like I need to write things down more often and I don't often carry my you know my big wallet version you know to meetings I don't carry it to meetings and things like that I just want to have this with me so that I can pop quick notes in there as I need to so I kind of thought I might pop some um, patches on here uh, I just think it's a really sweet little notebook 
Like these two are probably my favorites out of all of them. Um, but I really like these big ones and I want to come up with a way to use these. I think this would look really nice on the olive, for example. That kind of mustard color there goes really nicely. So I'm actually going to hang out with some friends today and I'm going to try to put these patches on. I mean, it's not hard to do, but it's hard to commit to the placement. <laughs> anyway, this can also have patches on it. So, you know, maybe this could go on here or something. Um, I'm really excited to have some fun and play around with these. All right, there's one more package, the big one. Let's open it up. I'm so excited, <laughs> excited about this. I have um, had this on my list for such a long time and I just love the packaging here. Let me just move these out of the way. This packaging is beautiful. Um, I love the purple. I don't think I can undo it like this. I think it actually ties a knot. So I better do it the other way. I can't, I can't even. Okay, let's hop into it. Okay, let's see. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's beautiful. Okay. I can't off the top of my head remember what this is called, but maybe it tells us inside. It doesn't, but I think it's a, I mean, it's from the Superior Labour, but I just can't remember what it's called. So the patch inside says the Superior Labour. Um, so it's this beautiful little canvas bag painted with this beautiful pink color. I'm going to pop the name of the bag on screen so you can, you can um, see what it is. And I'll put the link to it in the description as well. So, so this is something where a big patch could go on it, right? A big shape the future on here somewhere would look cool. I don't, I haven't, you know, thought about whether it would stick or not. Um, this would also be good because the pinks match, um, maybe on the back even, centered over that. But anyway, let's look at the bag. I'm so excited. Um, so it has leather, um, pull here that clasps over that little, uh, knob. I don't know what that's called. And we've got two little rivets here, which are beautiful, holding this on. Um, it's got D-rings on the side attached with really strong leather there. Uh, and it it doesn't come with a strap because they have a bunch that you can choose from and I didn't get one tell me why I don't remember um, but I have some straps here as well that I thought I might try I think that's probably why I didn't uh, on the back we have a zipper quite deep it comes down to this stitch line here and a nice it's a nice zipper as well with a leather pull and then inside, it's pretty roomy, actually bigger than I thought, which is awesome. I wasn't sure how big it would be. And it's got a pocket here oh, with some information on it as well from the superior labor. So cool, so cool. I love it, love it, love it. So let me see, do I have a standard size traveler's notebook here? Yes, I do. So I've got my black one from Bumkuchen, just for size comparison. So you can see it's bigger than a T, like a regular TN. I've got my little blue passport and I've got my olive passport, which are both chunky. And there's still plenty of room for more. So this one could fit in there as well. Still plenty of room to move around. Heaps of space in there, as you can hopefully see. So it's quite a roomy bag. It's so nice. And I think if you compare it, not compare, I think if you paired it with um, like a crossbody strap, a large crossbody strap um, in a pink, for me, it'd be pink, um, or you could go with the leather. Um, I think it would look really nice. 
I just love this color combination so much. Oh, it's beautiful. So I had planned to just use this to put like planner stuff in, but I'm actually thinking it might become my everyday carry. Maybe, because what I take with me to work, I have two bags I take to work. One has the laptop in it. It's just an envelope sleeve. It has the laptop, my Remarkable, and my TN that I use for work, and then my glasses and things like that. But in my handbag that I take to work, I usually just have my, um, my regular TN wallet, and then now I will add the blue one, oh, it's the, the little brown one, and my glasses and like a little pouch full of lip products and medications and stuff like that. That's pretty much all I ever need with me and my, my regular glasses. So let's come back and do a what fits in here video next time. Um, I think I'll give it a go and see how, how I'm using it and then I can report back and see what fitted in here. Oh, it's so pretty and I have to find a strap now. Um, part of me wishes I'd bought one so it was all done but um, that's okay I will find one and attach it and see how we go so excited okay let's have a quick look at everything together okay there we go there's my collection of beautiful new goodies from Balm Kuhn uh, they're, they're just beautiful I love them super excited to see how I'm gonna put this all together um, yeah, stay tuned. You, soon you will see um, reptilians covered in patches, most likely. But anyway, let's see how we go. I'm very excited again. I love this and I can't wait to put this in my brown um, passport as well. Looking forward to it. All right. Thanks everyone for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this one and uh, let me know what you think. Let me know what you think of this beautiful Superior Labour bag. It's my first item from the Superior Labour, I think. Um, Yes, I love it. It's gorgeous. All right. Thanks again. And I'll see you all super, super soon. Bye.